Welcome back to our channel, She Said. He Said. I'm Rasha. And I'm Jay. Thanks for joining us. Jay, go ahead and tell them what our channel is all about. Our channel is about relationship topics, and we just give our views and opinion from a woman and a man's perspective. So thank you for joining. If this is your first time, please consider subscribing. And if you're returning, we thank you. Thank you. All right, so let's go ahead and get into today's topic. So today's topic, we're discussing what? Relationship deal breakers. Ooh. I didn't do the good crack sound. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, so relationship deal breakers. So if you had to name a relationship deal breaker, what would be one for you? Um, let me think. Let me think. Maybe you should go first. Oh my gosh, really? Don't be trying to put it on me. Yeah. <laughs> You're more um, of the deal breaker type person. Uh, so nothing is a deal breaker. Yeah. I don't know. I honestly got to think. You I really gotta I, step your standards up or something, dude. Jeez. I accept people the way they are. <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, if I had to name a relationship deal breaker, it would be for me a negative person. That is a true relationship deal breaker. I'm like positive, upbeat, you know, just I, I like positive energy. Don't come to me with a lot of negativity. We all get down. We all, you know, have our days, but bounce back. Don't just stay stuck in that negative, you know, woe is me, life is over, what am I going to do? I, I, I like, I mentally have to block that out because that seeps into me and I'm just like, then I become that person and not, I, you know how they say, what is it called? Like a transfer of emotions that happens. So I don't want that to happen because that's not my aura. That's not who I am. So that would be like a very big deal breaker for me. Why are you being so negative? Um, positive. <laughs> that negative energy brings me down. <laughs> Check it. Fast and furious, huh? Yes, yes. Why are you being so negative, bro? <laughs> yes. Okay. So it's on you. And, um, I don't know, honestly. Oh my, are you serious? How, how are we going to have a discussion and you don't even know what a deal breaker would be? There's nothing on your hair. Um, I don't know. We different. I mean, you have deal breakers. Maybe I don't have deal breakers. Maybe I, I don't know. I'm not saying I don't have any deal breakers. I just, mm -hmm. I don't know. So someone, you know me. I mean, someone that that like didn't take care of their hygiene or attempt to that wouldn't be a deal breaker for you. Well, yeah, you got to wash. <laughs> so I mean, <laughs> so proper that, hygiene that'd be a deal breaker. <laughs> you need to wash. All right. You need to wash and brush your teeth you and go. all that good stuff and yes. take care of yourself. I mean, everybody stinks at some point, but at least yeah. you know try to try to clean yourself. Yeah. 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 Okay. So see, you got a deal breaker. All right. We Appreciate found you. one for you. Yay. Thanks for helping me out. You're welcome. So, okay, I guess it's back on me. Yeah, um, what you got? You got all the good stuff. <laughs> I, know I just that. got standard stuff. Do you even have that? No. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I got some type of standards. I'm with her, right? Well, I mean, if I do say so myself, I mean, I'm fabulous. Mm. <laughs> what? Mm. No, I'm really not going to see it. Not at all. Not at all. What do you got? What do you got? Um, I would say another one for me would be lack of ambitions. Like, you know, probably at least by the second conversation, you're discussing, you know, just your life dreams, goals. And then the person is just like, I mean, you know, I mean, just you good. Well, what are you good doing? I mean, you know, just, I'm just good where I'm at. No, I don't, you know, pretty much to me, that sounds like you don't want to grow. You don't want to prosper. You don't want to challenge yourself to be better. You're just complacent and you're stuck in that spot. You have no ambitions. You have no goals. You, I just, I can't deal. Mm -hmm. So that'd be a deal breaker. Okay. I got another one while mm -hmm. I was, while you was talking. Mm -hmm. I was listening to you actually. You, you actually were? Yeah. Oh, okay. But I was able to actually think of something oh, at the same time. Gosh. Yeah. <sighs> It's unheard of. <laughs> Listen, so I was thinking of another one, and that's 
attitude. Hmm. What about attitude? The fact that, and we've discussed this before, we might even talk about it on this another video, but I know mm -hmm. we have in general, is you can be the finest woman in the world. Mm -hmm. You can just be just downright gorgeous, mm -hmm. you know, outward appearance. Mm -hmm. But if your attitude is just a bad attitude, then you're, that's ugly to me, you know? Like what, like, oh, no, you didn't. Did you really just say that to me right now? I didn't say that. Like, like who, who do you think that you are? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, how dare you think that you can talk to me any type of way? You're beneath me. You mean like that? That's, that's a good start. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm just saying, like, you know, it don't matter how beautiful you are on the outside. If you have a ugly inside, like, that would be a deal breaker for me, you know? Yeah, so I think that, that would be... And sometimes you, you find that out right away, mm -hmm. you know? I mean, you can find that out right now. I mean, you can go on social media or anywhere and stuff. Mm -hmm. You see people that, oh, man, they're beautiful. And then you see how they treat other people and how they act and how they whatever. And it's mm -hmm. like, oh, no. Nah. You can keep that to yourself. Mm. All right. Keep on rolling. <laughs> um, that's a good one. I would say another deal breaker for me would be um, a person with no patience. Like, um, in life, you have to have patience. Everything is not going to come to you right away. You know, you're not going to get things done right away. We all get impatient about things. So that's not to say that, you know, none of us get impatient. But I'm just saying that's just like if that's your general personality is everything is, oh, my gosh, when is it going to happen? I mean, could they move a little bit faster? Oh, right. And push, you know, like, are you like that? No. No. Okay, well, then I'm not talking about you. Were you trying to put yourself on blast? Maybe. Sometimes. <laughs> yeah. No, I mean. <laughs> Everybody has a little bit of impatience. Yeah, everybody but, does. You know, so yeah. I'm just that's what I'm saying. When that's just your who generally who you are for me, that's a deal breaker. Um, like you just don't have patience for anything. Like that's just I can't cope because then you're you're rushing life. You're not enjoying the moments that you're in. You, you're basically trying to stress me out, and I can't have that. So I just can't cope. Mm -hmm. So that'd be a deal breaker. Okay, that's a good one. What about for you? I don't know, I wasn't thinking that time. I was really actually just listening to you the whole time. Oh, you're working on your listening skills. Yeah. Look at you. Yeah. yeah, sometimes these videos are therapy for us as well. They are therapy. <laughs> First time I heard her say that. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, so... It's like our, what, 30-second video, maybe? Yes, it is a 30-second. Something like that, 30-second. On, on the road, too. Yeah. Many, many more. Yeah. <laughs> we only even got 32 followers. <laughs> really? <laughs> But we're growing. It's patience, like she just said. Yeah, thank you. Patience. Okay, there you go. Patience. And that takes time. It, it takes time. And so there are a lot of things that take time. So have a little patience. Yeah. So any other things that would be deal breakers for you? Um, nothing I can really think of that just jumps out off the top of my head. But, you know, I would want somebody that's on the same... We all have our own different journeys and things that we want to do or accomplish in life. Mm -hmm. But having somebody that's a goal oriented and a team player, basically, mm -hmm. of what you're trying to accomplish. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? If you're working together, you know, we're married. So everything that we do, everything that we bring in, you know, to this household, you know, mm -hmm. income wise goes into one pot, you mm -hmm. know. And it's to help build us up, you know, to you know, take care of ourselves, take care of our kids, mm -hmm. so on and so forth. So somebody that is on that same pathway that's on your team, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And, like, it doesn't mean that you don't have your own individual things that you want to accomplish or that I don't have my own individual things. But somebody that has your back that's a team player, basically, that you come together and, you know what I mean, and, mm -hmm. and push towards you know, some common goals, basically, to to better yourselves as a couple. Very nice. Yes, I would agree with that. You definitely do need to be on the same wavelength and have the same values and, and goals because, um, you know, collectively you want to be working towards the same thing. It's going to help you grow uh, better as a team and help you to grow your empire better, you know. Mm -hmm. um, I thought of another one. 
What's this that? is like probably like the number one thing for me that's like a complete deal breaker. You know what it is? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> no, selfishness. You know, I do not like a selfish person. Like, mm -hmm. I consider myself, I think my family would agree that I'm like one of the most selfless people. Um, and I just, I can't stand just someone that just is so solely focused on them, on their goals, on their ambitions and on what pleases them. I, I really like that. Just ugh, like that gets to me. And yeah, I agree with you on that. <laughs> you know, the world is so much bigger than me. It's so much bigger than you. It's so much bigger than you and I, mm -hmm. you know, you, you can't be selfish in this world. And, and when you grow in life, there are other people that are pushing you, that are helping you, that are guiding you. Um, strangers, you know, a stranger can say just one word to you, and, <clears throat> excuse me, and that pushes you, mm. that propels you, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, of course, your friends, your family, just associates, I mean, you can't be selfish, just, you just can't, there's no way. And I see so much of it in the world, everybody is trying to get theirs, everybody is, is out for themselves, and, or not everybody, I'm sorry, a lot of people that I see that in, and you'll end up finding out you're going nowhere fast. Yeah. Um, and when you are able to help another person, when you're able to encourage someone else, what that does for your spirit, what that does just for you as a person, mm -hmm. like it's invaluable. So, and I definitely feel like no one should be selfish on this earth. Yeah. No, I agree with you on that. That's a big one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, anything else? I got one other little thing. Mm -hmm. Nitpicking. <laughs> Give me an example. Nitpicking about the, the smallest things, mm -hmm. you know, like money. Mm. Just nitpicking. You know what? If they're trying, they got, they're on a tight budget and they're trying to make sure, you know, the money's right, you know. I mean, or truth be told, all of us should be on a budget. Mm -hmm. We should all be on a budget. Mm -hmm. But there's also a different thing between being on a budget mm -hmm. and just being like a downright cheapskate. And just nitpicking about every penny, mm -hmm. you know what I mean, and that you know, that that just irks me, mm -hmm. you know. It's an irk of mine. It's an irk, just like that. You gotta you know, be like, like irk, 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 yeah, irk, 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 irk. but you gotta, yeah. Okay. Cause that's hitting the brakes. Nope, <laughs> not doing it. <laughs> All right. Broke the deal. Broke it. Nope. Oh, wow. Fall apart. Can't Ain't be just, fixed. Just right there. Just can't even. Ain't can't no, get a minute together. No Humpty Dumpty. No you can't even glue. put you back together again. Mm. Or nothing. Dang. That's messed up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Will you have anything else? No. Nah, we will. All right. Well, we'll go ahead and wrap it up. Um, yeah. As always, believe in love, believe in yourself, and believe in each other. And we'll see you on the next video. Peace.